All right, we got an experiment here. So I have three pieces, uh, six inches length of half inch diameter hemp rope. This is the real deal stuff. I bought it from RW Rope. Um, just some cheap whippings on the end to keep it from unraveling. And I got three different types of tar. I got Brickmore Pine Tar. I bought that from the local uh, ranching supply store. It says it's light pine tar. It's meant for horse hooves. And then we got pine tar I made myself from uh, what I think was a pine tree. I found it at the dump. It's not very pure. It's got a bunch of crap in it. Um, it was basically the entire burn is in there. And then I've got real Stockholm tar that I also bought from RW Rope. It's Davian Company Stockholm tar. It's already making a mess. It uh, came in a bag there. But anyway, the idea is I'm going to literally just dip these pieces of rope in each one of the things and see what they come out like. So let's try not to get tar over my phone. I already ruined my shirt. <laughs> Alright, so we got the uh, Davy and Company tar over here. Very much your typical tar. It's a... Uh, it's got something going for it that the others don't. It's not like thick per se, but I mean it's not viscous. It's still pretty runny in there. But it's definitely like the best coating job from just dipping it. I mean that's that thing's coated and it's it's the darkest of all of these for sure, but I'm really surprised by how similar it is to the Brickmore tar for horse hooves. I first tried that on Manila and thought it wasn't working well, but now that it's hemp, it's like, yeah, that's that's tar, man. So, then in it, it's different. It makes it just a little bit more wholesome as tar, if you know what I mean. I don't know how to explain it. I'm not sure what I'm talking about, really. Like, this calls itself light pine tar. If that's light pine tar, this is heavy pine tar, you know? The most interesting here, though, is really my homemade stuff, because it's got a very golden color, golden tree sap color to it, just like the sap of the tree I made it from. And, uh, it got a really nice coat on the bottom there. It needs a bit more towards the top probably, but I just dipped it, you know, and so then it runs down. So all of these are kind of thinner at the top. But, uh, yeah, very, like, honey, honey color, golden brown. Beautiful color, actually.